you appear tired? Nora, how unexpected. What are you doing here? Uh, I have a toy for a tot. Shouldn't have. I didn't, actually. It was a passive-aggressive gift when Mary Louise came crawling back to me, but that hasn't happened, so... Still very generous of you. I know. Okay. You delivered it. Yay! That's the end. But how will the tot know the toys from me? I'll tell him. And you're still not leaving. I want to be more involved. See, I recently enrolled in classes and You're I... going to school here? Why? Because I was curious about college and, well, Mary Louise hated the idea, so... That's right. That's a good reason for higher education. Look, you clearly need help. Not from an evil heretic who kidnapped my friend. Are you really going to let that old news get in the way of a little charity? And I'm evil. Collection booth. The far one. Like, way over there. Hey, see it? See? Here you go. That's your gift. Stickers. Did you stop by the gas station on the way over or just fish them from the rubbish? Professor Dowling or Marcus? Excuse me? You're taking freshman English, right? Who's your professor? Please tell me it's Dowling and not Marcus. I can deal with difficult people. Oh, I know you can. Which is why I'm saying take Dowling. I don't want Professor Marcus to end up dead. I'm joking. Sort of. Let me guess. Hot cocoa and vervain? Close. Bourbon. I'm sorry I was harsh earlier. I heard you listen to Valerie and that you sided with Lily against Julian. I mean, you must be attempting to turn over a new leaf and you clearly don't have anyone else. Lovely. A pity friend, just what I always wanted. College can be lonely and terrible or it can be fun. A pity friend is still a friend. What do you need from me? Excuse me? I wasn't born yesterday, it's all right. I want to do some charity, I might as well start. Have you heard of a town called Sunbury? Can I have one of the boy toys? Of course you can. You can be anything you want. Don't let society tell you differently. What? Surprised I'm not massacring the leukemia patients. It's still early. Christmas was always my favorite holiday. When I was growing up, it was much different than all this. I would have been happy with a hoop and a stick. But still. Being surrounded by her loved ones. This looks just like her. <sighs> what? You and Mary Louise broke up. She made her choice. It was a bad one. But no buts. Okay, you need to move on and become your own person. And you can only do that if you're living in the present, not the past. Which means you need to stop thinking about her and talking about her, okay? She's dead to you. Am I? Can we talk? <laughs>